According to the data we found, there is a power plant near that's just been reassigned and designated as a Skell secret project. The whole thing is classified and very hush-hush. Military and tech specialists have been secretly flowing in to work on the project. You think the strategist could be involved? Not only that, I think it's our lead to finding Midas. May I present Project Claw? You find anything about the location of Claw? The project is massive. Somebody must know something. I like your thinking. I got a list of some names from the PC, all with ties to Claw. Are you Holly McKenzie? I can help with Legion. Get you a ten minute window so the plane can break in and then leave. I developed the algorithm, the language that made the drones able to behave autonomously. It seems the last of the data was uploaded from the drive. You should have everything you need. Very good. The funds should be in your account as we speak. You're pathetic. Deep Blue, I'm in Stephanie's neighborhood. You got any intel on her? Specializing in patent law. Not sure what brought her here, though. And why would Claw need a legal advisor? That doesn't make sense. I'll see what else I can dig up. Yeah. There's gotta be more to the story. Let me know what you find. Will do. Stephanie Burgess? Who are you? You don't look like Sentinel. Name's Nomad. Found your name tied to the Claw Project, and an individual known as the Strategist. I'm investigating the matter, and I have some concerns. Keep your voice down. I don't want people to hear us. Let's get out of town. We can find some place safe where we can talk. look like an outcast. Are you here to stop Claw? I'm not an outcast. But, yeah, Claw's far too dangerous to stay under Sentinel's control. I'd like to help you, but I can't tell you anything. They have eyes and ears everywhere. Anything I say will be traced back to me. What can I do to protect your safety? I was planning on running away from all of this. But in order to do that, I need to disappear from Sentinel's database. If you can erase my entire existence from the Sentinel files, I can talk a lot more freely. I'm not trying to be paranoid. It's super important. Just lead me in the right direction. Thank you. I'll give you a burner phone. Call me when you're done. Don't worry. It's encrypted. Where am I headed? There are boats on the shore just west of Liberty City. Take one and you'll be able to reach the naval base. That's where my data is being kept. Thanks. I'll call you when I'm done. Check the records. Stephanie, I've cleaned the slate for you. You've been scrubbed from the system. Thank you, Nomad. This means the world to me. Think you can talk freely now? Yes. I'm sending you coordinates for where we can meet. Once there, I'll tell you everything you need to know. Thanks. Looking forward to it. 
reached the rendezvous point, Stephanie. Where are you? Stephanie, where are you? I'm sorry, Nomad. I won't be joining you. I can't. Wait. What? Why? I have no choice. I need to tie up all of the loose ends. I need you to disappear. Forget we ever met. Oh, you got to be shitting me. Stephanie Burgess, and I don't like what I'm finding. We need to be careful that she's not tipping off the strategist about our activities. Yeah, let's tread lightly. Speaking of Stephanie, listen. I just interrogated one of the commanders from the clone list. Learned something interesting. Lay it on me. Burgess has gotten pretty chummy with his bodyguard of hers. A fellow by the name of Carl Sekulich. As part of Claw's VIP security detail, he probably knows where she's hiding. Carol Sekulich. He's on my claw list. Yeah, I guess that narrows down who I'll be investigating next. Deep Blue, I'm near Carol's camp. You got any intel on this guy? Just a bit for now. He's a wolf commander who is in charge of VIP security for the claw project. That's not much to go on. When I get any more leads, I'll give you a holler. Sounds good. something on Carl. Before he got recruited into the Wolves, he was part of a Russian spec op, part of the Bodark unit. Does that ring any bells? Bodark? Yeah. Yeah, I heard of them. They were one of the Ghost's top priorities a while back. How were you able to link Carol to that so quickly, huh? I called up Cost. I wanted to see if he knew anything about the Wolves. It took some work to get it out of him, but apparently... This Carl guy applied to Paladin 9 soon after he defected. And get this, he got rejected for being too laid back. Now that sounds like somebody I need to be. What the hell happened here? You must be the ghost that I've been hearing so much about. Are you Carol Sekulich? I am, yes. You know who I am and you know what I do. You're being awfully cavalier, especially for a wolf. I just heard from Stephanie. Sounds like she gave you some trouble. So, you two are close, huh? Well, I've been through worse, but I'm certainly not too keen on her right now. Listen, I can lead you to her. I can even make sure she gives you all the info she has on Claw. But first, I need a favor. I'm listening. The thing of it is, I'm looking to disappear. Defect, as it were, from the wolves. The corpses in the mission schedule. It was all falsified as part of my ploy to escape this life. That's a pretty severe plan. That's not even half of it. I wanted others to think I was hot on the ghost's trail. I had plans to stage a whole ghost operation at the dam, where I'd die in a transformer explosion. But then you show up, 
And you thought that dying at the hands of an actual ghost was more credible. Can't say I disagree. Something like that. Glad to hear we're on the same page. Do me a favor. Place these on the body. You'll also find a radio device on the body so that we can communicate. Once this is all finished, I'll tell you anything you need to know about Claw and the strategist. Works for me. You know. I was watching from a distance. I wouldn't let you do this completely on your own. Okay. So what do we need to do before we blow this thing up? Well, there are two things to check. First, you must falsify the visitor log, signing my name to it. Secondly, I need you to disarm the failsafe device for the Transformers. It doesn't matter which order you do them in. All right. By the way, whose radio is this? It's mine. I need to know before we blow this popsicle stand. No. Feel free to light it up. So I've helped you out with your problem. Can you help me out with mine? Let's cut through the bullshit, shall we? I'm the head of VIP security for Claw and the tactical advisor for the strategist. I consulted on classified spec ops tactics. I'm guessing it involved one of your friends. Midas? Possible. Whomever it was had a difficult time with interrogation. Quite difficult. Where can I find him? Stephanie Burgess. I figure you're gonna want to be online for this. Things are about to get interesting. Sure as hell sounds like it. Thanks. I hope you have a
a good explanation for all of this. If they come after us, it'll be your fault, Carol. I understand. Listen, I'm on your side. If we can just get to Claw, nobody will come after you. Being a ghost is great and all, but you have no idea what you're up against. Look, I work for Lomax Faro, the developers behind Claw. One of the founders is Michael Lomax, a U.S. Senator from the Subcommittee of Defense. He's been using his influence to create mandates and fund his own research and projects like CLAW. So he uses taxpayer money to fund his CLAW project? And he has mandates to develop it? That complicates my job. The other co-founder is Lomax's associate, Faro. He's the strategist. And he's been using all of that money, control, and power to further this project. Seems like some very deep state stuff. It is. Whichever U.S. official it was who sent you after Claw is thinking several steps ahead. Either they know about the strategist's plans, or something else is brewing. I wish I could tell you more. That should be enough info for you to get started. I'm sure you'll have a lot of fun digging through this shit. It's time we go. The island is locked down. Where will you go? Don't worry about us. I know a couple of places that will keep us safe. Keep close to your radio, though. I'm sure our paths will cross again. Deep Blue, you got all that? Yeah, and I don't like it one bit. This wasn't in the briefing. Now, if you don't mind me asking, who sent you this assignment? The CIA. Came through the same way the rest of my assignments do. Come to think of it, the timing seems a little suspicious. I was asked to capture the strategists not too long before they were rolled. Uh, it just seems too convenient. What if someone in the CIA knew a role was going to be on lockdown? Hmm? Maybe there's more to this mission than simply capturing the strategist. What if it's an extraction? Look, if they knew about a role, they knew their activities might alert the ghosts. Or worse, that we would intervene. If me or any of the other ghosts got our hands on Pharaoh, we'd lean on him, his friends in the Senate, and all their private interests. It'd be a bad, bad scene. Yeah, this is a deep state matter. Stuff of conspiracy theorists and crackpots. I know it's hard to believe, but you might be working for the wrong side. You think about it. If slush fund money can control technology like Claw, and if it's dictating company and DOD movement, then there's no telling how deep it runs. <laughs> that would be inconvenient, wouldn't it? Look, I'm gonna continue with the mission. But once that's done, I'll only hand Pharaoh over to my most trusted contacts. Because you're right. Something smells fishy. Agreed. <laughs>